Salut. Ah, perfect. Gracias. Gracias. So today, I believe, is day eight out here on snow for me. And I finally got the clear to do some backflips on snow. So stay tuned for the video and let's get into some skiing out here. Yeah, you'll get out of Hi, Danny. Sick. Yes, Danny. That was dope. So yesterday I finally got the clear to do some backflips on snow from the physio because he didn't think it would be too much more impact than just doing straight airs out here. So we're going to try to warm up to that today, that's the goal. Um, but if I'm being honest, my back isn't feeling very good this morning. It's definitely a bit more sore than I think it should be. I don't know if you can hear the snow right now, but it's pretty fucking firm out right now. So we'll see how it warms up, see if the course softens up, see if my back warms up into the skiing today, and hopefully we can go ski some jumps out there. So for this run, I'm just doing one run of flat to try and get moving. Then I'm going to hit one run of adjust middle section skiing. And hopefully that's enough to get my back feeling a little bit more up to speed. So, yeah. I'll uh, catch you guys on that middle section run now. Good morning, yeah. <laughs> Wake up. Yeah, holy shit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, definitely snows fast. I think you weren't quite prepared for it on those first couple, but I think nice job in here. Nice containment of the feet, lots of front of blue. Good job with the arms. Down here, you can see just start diving the upper body a little bit down the middle. That's when you get that little bit more rotation, a little bit more feet away, a little bit more anchor the arm after pull plan. Yeah. Just shortcutting with the body just a little bit. Okay, make yeah. sure it's like a good shift over yeah. the yeah, slow like down. Yeah, just like the middle of that. That middle section really nice. Okay, yeah. sounds good. good. Sounds good. I think I'll try to hit top air this run. Yeah. So that's first run to the course. Feeling super firm. I really had to get my absorption going there and get that moving. So see how many of these I have in me today, but I'm gonna try to get off that top air now. Make a hopefully a first full top to bottom run, I guess, with two jumps for this camp and see how that one goes. Uh, today is the last day of camp. It's our last day out here in Chile. Tomorrow we start our mega travel day home. But I don't want to push it too much today and get too much pain for that because sitting's really bad. So I'm going to try to keep it within reason today, see how it goes.
First one. Hey, uh, Phil was wondering if you forgot to press play. I did. That is what <laughs> happened, unfortunately. <laughs> Good job. I'm, I'm happy with this middle. Like, yeah, you'll see a couple of mistakes here and there, but overall the base, very nice movement, and I like that you're, like the initial movement of absorption is strong, and where you need control, you're putting a little bit of resistance, but staying in the top. That's good, Dan. Okay. That's nice okay. to control. Well done. Nice. Well done. I definitely felt that, like, first thing today, that I need to put more power in the face yeah. on the sharp ones. Lots of speed on that initial movement, lots of power, but just like you did there, like you saw those ones where it was almost like, and the body just pressed through his face and was right there on the backside, right? Yeah, that's, that's a good feeling. Uh, matrix style. <laughs> yeah. Uh, could I do a back cross on bottom first? Yeah, yeah. I don't know how many I got, I'm definitely feeling it, so. Yeah, kind of want to just do one. Yeah, do it in sections if you want, whatever. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. Nice, let's go. That's my uh, first top to bottom for the whole camp. Two jumps, full middle section. Super stoked on that. It felt pretty in control. Um, didn't feel amazing on my back, that's for sure. But uh, gonna head up this run and go try to do the first backflip. Gonna do a back cross on bottom. Hopefully it goes well. Gonna hit it in sections probably. Hit top air, ski out most of the metal and then pull out right before bottom and just hit a good back cross and yeah let's get upside down for the first time Oh baby. Okay. <sighs> oh fuck yeah. Oh, I love getting upside Boy, down. Man. Yes. It's been a long time uh, that you didn't slip or? First one in the camp, <laughs> yeah. First one since May camp. I, uh, <laughs> I think I have it for sure, but... Uh, Phil, I have Joey. Phil uh, asked me for a cookie, I threw him a cookie and then <laughs> on the run. I think I... Oh, shit. Oh, it's all good. It was important for you. It, it, that jump, everything go a little bit to the right naturally. Okay. You need to force it. Oh, that's a nice press. Phil, you ready? You need to force it to. Um, you see, just the alignment of your skis. Yeah, you're pointing a little bit right. Yeah. yeah. Like just force it that you go slightly uh, left. Track yeah. a little left. Yeah. Sounds good. Because the jump is pointing there. I like connection with the the tip. Most of them, you know, most like you, you touch at least, even if it's not pure, pure, uh, pure line, you touch, you know, the forward or the tip a little bit. The yeah. first, the first turn, the first turn was a little axe shot, like, like you, you were like, dang. Yeah. <laughs> you can be just a little bit more smooth with that one, a little bit more tip ear. 
just like tip 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 and you give you yeah. more fluidity and probably on your body it's probably way smoother better yeah over a few more moguls yeah. slow it down <laughs> that makes sense stay forward like you see like as at one point you came back with those hips and those hands a little bit more yeah. you see it when you're a little bit kind of unsure your hands are wide yeah. and as soon as you come feet you came oh. back with what we work in may and yeah. yeah sounds good sounds good So that was my third run. Uh, yeah, pretty pretty stoked on that. So happy to get upside down again. Uh, obviously nothing special, it's just a back cross. But I mean, first one, first slip on snow since May. So feeling pretty stoked on that. Ah, maybe I did a couple cork sevens in, uh, in um, June or July and momentum. So maybe not first flip since May, but still it's been a while. Got the nerves going. Felt super good to get upside down again. And uh, yeah, that was pretty exciting. So let's go do, do another run. Didn't get any pain in my back or anything crazy. Honestly felt smoother than the straighters I've been hitting on the landing. So let's go do another one and think about maybe flipping top air. I don't know, it's really windy up there. And that jump's not super amazing. It doesn't feel so great. So, yeah, I'm gonna think about it. Gonna think about it on the T-bar right up here. Chasing it. Chasing the feet. Took it up on the bottom there. Good job. And it, it's kind of, I would say it's almost from turn one. Like, sure, a little bit yeah. exit. But if you look at that top section, like, that's, it's not amazing. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I'm sure you fought, I would say, majority of that run. But. Yeah, that top section's hard. It's like nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah. Last two mega, like, across the hills. Yeah, it's it's just all about position and control. Yeah, come do in what you need to do to you know it's a deer valley top section almost. Yeah, just hit top air balance, yeah. good speed. Yeah, good job on the bottom. Nice, nice. I think I might try for one more. It's yeah. like starting to hurt, but okay. kind of want to do one more. <laughs> Alright, so that one went okay. A little bit loose on that skiing, that exit up top. But I mean, first top to bottom with the back cross, so that's exciting. Let's uh, go hit one more run on the day. One more run, try to do a little cleaner skiing, cleaner exit, better entrance up top. And yeah, let's do it again. Flip the flip, baby. Boy, Danny. Nice. It's a good end of camp. Yeah, stoked on that. 
good job. You back away. You went big up top. Definitely a lot stronger attack on the exit. Set you up. Nice middle. Nice. Good job. Nice. Good job. Yeah, the exits are easier when you don't have time to stare at them. That's true, isn't it? <laughs> Really good job, Danny. I'm impressed. I like felt on the slowing down, a conscious movement unto oh, stay yeah. like left, like, going sideways. Like two ago, where you had that good length and tall in the face, and everything carried over strong. Yeah. Nice, really nice, sweet. Thank you. I choked on that. <laughs> There's the, there's the answer. Yeah, just take like one hand and And then, like, start a back to the Oh no! Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it for the camp out here in Chile. Hopefully you guys enjoyed those videos from here. And uh yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next one in the next place where we go skiing. Not sure what that's gonna be just yet, but hopefully you guys enjoy those videos. Catch you on the next one. Danny, let's go! Danny Tanner vlogs. <laughs>